<clears throat> There's a drill I like to use. I don't use it as much now, but I used to use it um, to practice moving my hands and my feet at the same time. When you're fighting somebody, they're gonna be moving forward, they're gonna be moving backwards. As you punch, they're gonna be moving left, right, they're gonna be circling out. When you stand in front of a heavy bag, a lot of people, they stand in front of a heavy bag and they just plant and throw shots from here. But the person's not gonna stay there. After you, when you throw one shot, they're already moving. They're already moving after the first, second shot. So you gotta practice moving with them and away from them. So a good way to practice Moving your hands and feet at the same time is you have to imagine you're kind of like a puppet and you have a string attached from your hand to your foot, your right hand to your right foot, your left hand to your left foot. As the punch goes out, that foot drops. Same thing on the other side, boom. And just practice doing this, going back and forth. It looks a little silly, but when you start using it, and you start training your feet and hands to move at the same time, it'll come out a lot easier. Go left, go right, circles. Just focus on, as soon as the hand goes out, your foot drops. As soon as the hand goes out, your foot drops. And you should turn your foot on that cross at the same time. That way, when you're throwing your shots and the person's moving, pa, 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 you're already following them with your shots. Instead of overreaching and trying to reach super far. Same thing, if you're fighting on the back foot, they're chasing you. Boom, 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 boom. So you can practice that drill for, you know, a few rounds as a warm up. You get a little faster with it. Throw uppercuts with them, hooks. But you gotta get those feet and those hands moving at the same time. Try that drill out, let me know how it goes.